Okay, so what's up guys, welcome back to yet another video. We have a new update rolling out for OnePlus 9 and 9 Pro. And this is based on stable version of Oxygen OS. So in this video, let's take a quick look what all changes they have done with this latest update for OnePlus 9 and 9 Pro. Before starting the video, thank you so much guys for completing the like target of 400 likes on our previous video. Let's keep the same like target. And as you all know, we have 80% of users who haven't subscribed to our channel. So it's a humble request. Do consider subscribing and also press the bell icon to get notified whenever we upload a new video. So here I have my OnePlus 9. I've already installed this OTA update and the update size was quite small which was around 68 MB. Update is rolling out in batches, so it might take some time to receive it on your device. If you guys don't receive it, then I'll try to provide OTA update files in the description below. Just download the OnePlus local update application and install it manually. First, let's talk about the software information. So here we can see Android version is Android 12. We have the security patch of 5th December 2021 and the similar security patch was present on previous update, which was version C.39. If you go to the version, here you can see the version says C.40. So this is the latest build for OnePlus 9 and 9 Pro. Talking about the benchmark results, on this latest update, single core have scored 884 and multi core have scored 3302. Towards the right hand side, those scores were from the previous update and almost similar scores to be seen on both these updates. With the Antutu benchmark application, current version which is C.40 have scored 7,72,878. On the previous update, scores were 7,73,546. So slightly higher benchmark results were on the previous update with Antutu benchmark application. And if you guys are looking for these live wallpapers, these are from MIUI 13. We have already made a video on this. You can download the MIUI 13 live wallpapers from the description below. Basically, this update doesn't bring any kind of new add-ons to the previous build of Oxygen OS. Here you can take a look at the change logs which are related to system and network and the update size was around 67 MB. We'll talk about these change logs later. First let me show you whether previous bugs have been fixed or not. If you guys aren't aware, we always do an in-depth review of the updates being rolled out for OnePlus phones. We also did the in-depth review of our previous build which was C.39 and that had too many UI glitches. So before updating the device to the latest build, make sure to check that video out and I'll be using my OnePlus 9 as a daily driver running latest build which is version C.40 and I'll also update you guys if I find any bugs while using the device. So if you guys can wait for a day or two then wait for my complete review. After my review if I find the build is good enough to be used as daily driver then I'll let you know guys. So one of the bugs which I previously found on version C.39 was related to widgets and let's check whether that thing has been taken care or not. So we'll use the OnePlus stock widget, we'll add it on the home screen and now we'll try to resize the same. Previously while resizing, time used to get cropped and let's see and here you can see it's the same thing on this current build also. The timing and the first alphabet of day gets completely cropped off. So this issue have been still not taken care by OnePlus. And this case is not only with OnePlus stock widget, with clock widget also we get to see the same thing. On the previous update, camera version was 3.404.121 but on the latest update, it's slightly upgraded and now version is .124. So I don't think there will be major improvements in the camera segment though I'll still cover the camera part in the review video. And also guys, do let me know in the comment section below if you guys face any kind of issues so that I get tested on my device and update you guys in the review video. And hats off to OnePlus, we still don't have this 90 FPS support in Battlegrounds Mobile India. Let me show you the graphic settings on my OnePlus 9. So the lobby setting is set to smooth and 90 FPS, wherein device should deliver 90 FPS. But here you can see, we only get 60 FPS. So once again, good job OnePlus. Now let's take a look at the change logs. So the first change log is layered to system, in which they have fixed the issue of system upgrade failure in specific scenarios. On the previous update, lot many users used to complain about the system update issue that whenever they used to check the system update section, they used to see a pop-up says the owner can only upgrade the device. For me personally, there were no issues layered to system update. So if any one of you must have faced that issue, update to the latest build, hopefully that should fix the issue of system update error. And the last fix is layered to network in which they have fixed some issues layered to 5G network. Though here in India, we are still struggling to get better 4G connection. So we are not exactly sure how many more years we have to wait for a better 5G connectivity. So guys, this was a quick look on the latest update for OnePlus 9 and 9 Pro. If you still have any kind of questions, let me know in the comment section below. And also make sure to drop all your issues or bugs you have been facing on Oxygen OS 12. I'll try to cover them in a review video. As of now, only this much in this video. I hope you guys like the video. If you like the video, then do give me a thumbs up. And also if you are new to our channel, then do not forget to subscribe the channel. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.